Hey, what's up skaters? Uh, today I'm just gonna talk about um, some wheels again. Now, um, from some of my videos, I had stated I had bought some wheels to, you know, try and find what I like and it's quite expensive. Um, so I came from riding the Lockins Spitfire these are 52s um or were 52s i don't know what they're at now these are 52s and i've only used them like twice um these are 53s and uh i use them a few times um so something to i guess to take into consideration is um find what works for you um, I discovered after going from the lock-in to the radial, the Spitfire radial by the way, um, and then going to the round that I like a wider wheel. Um, so let's see if you can tell. This one's wider, it just didn't wear down to it. Um, this one's about the same a little bit skinnier than this one um definitely the round this is a round one from rick though um i don't wear down through it too much so i don't know if it would have been a good wheel uh the contact patch looks kind of decent i guess i guess if i was to wear down better um so after going through, you know, the trials of my wheels, I discovered I like asymmetrical wheels. So what that means is it's going to be cut out on one side like this, like the lock-in, and uh, flat or round on the other. Now for asymmetrical wheels, the only ones that I've seen that do that um, is Spitfire and... Oh, yeah, uh, OJ. So I got some OJ uh elites so these are asymmetrical also on one end they're uh cut out the other end they're round like a regular wheel so these are the milton martinez 99a 54 millimeters um i'm currently impressed by these so what i got them you know i didn't expect to like them um they are bigger than what i ride i ride 52s normally stepping up to a 54 um, as you can see it there but <clears throat> really impressive um, these are asymmetrical also and they are wider these are OJ's elite formula and then let's compare to my old Spitfire sorry <laughs> a little bit smaller not too much So yeah, um, all these are the best formulas that they have, and uh, I will be selling these and these. Um, if maybe these, I don't know. You can check them out on eBay. I have them listed. Um, I'm also selling some other stuff. If you wanna get or buy some, let me know. Um, check me out on Instagram, Mike L fifty fifty. So let me just turn these wheels to give you a better look at them. Oh, hold on. Damn it, this cat. There you go. So as you can see, that's a classic Rick the round formula this is a spitfire radial formula for and a spitfire lock-in formula for um so this one i i ended up loving simply because of the locking in doesn't make much of a difference with these but i kind of noticed a little bit of weight shaved off with that conical end but um, 
I, I like those a lot actually but uh, it's a lot it's an all-around great wheel this one also a great wheel I just I'm heavier so I noticed that for this one um, since I'm bigger you know the I, I like the wider contact patch like these so like I said maybe I didn't wear them down enough because they don't seem too bad the Richter round uh, Rapido 53 Spitfire radio 52 and then 52 lock in maybe 51 I don't know but um these are the OJ elites. I was kind of skeptical at first, um, as you know, OJ's not. Oh, to me, I have never ridden any OJs, and um, so yeah. I mean, I was just skeptical, so I decided I'm gonna try these because it's a shape I like. It's a duro durometer I like. Um, I do like 99A. That's all I kind of ride. Um, I heard with OJ's that you know they're grippy and they are grippier so but these also slide uh, good which is kind of odd because these grip a lot more than I need them to sometimes when I use them at least uh, versus these slide better so I don't know I mean you got to kind of test out your just test it out and find out what you like the only thing is these do add weight these are keeping your board kind of light and uh still keeping it good but um like i said if you're not too heavy skinny or regular wheels would be perfect for you if you find you know the board's hefty then you're probably going to want to go to this type of wheel if you're cool with it I, you'd have to lighten your trucks a little maybe get some hollows or titaniums or I mean people some people just ride it like that and can handle it but uh, once you get up to 8.5 you definitely feel a lot of weight board is one of them uh, your trucks obviously wheel size will affect it uh, right now I have venture hollows I'm selling my titaniums uh, then I'm gonna go back to indie but um Definitely recommend OJ Elites. Um, any of the Elites will probably be great. I Like I said, I cannot do 101 or 100s. Uh, it's weird to me. <laughs> so all I get is 99s. And uh, if you can pick up some of these, I recommend it. Or these. Or the Spitfires. Thanks guys. See you later.